सो हे यूट्यूब फैमिली वेलकम बैक टू द वीडियो आई होप यू गाइज आर डूइंग एक्सट्रीमली वेल सो लॉट ऑफ पीपल वर रिक्वेस्टिंग मी टू ब्रिंग सम इम्पॉर्टेंट क्वेश्चन ऑफ दिस सब्जेक्ट ऑल्सो कंप्यूटर ऑर्गेनाइजेशन एंड डिजाइन सो बट बिफोर प्रोसीडिंग फर्दर इन द वीडियो आई वॉन्ट टू आस्क वन थिंग आर यू गाइज रियली वरीड अबाउट दिस सब्जेक्ट इफ यस देन प्लीज लेट मी नो इन द कमेंट बॉक्स एंड प्लीज डू नॉट वरीड अबाउट दिस सब्जेक्ट go through all the 60 questions which i will discuss and i have already discussed you will find the video in description box and the playlist of this subject i have discussed 20 most important frequently asked mcqs of each unit i mean means 60 total 60 questions we have discussed from the three units so go through all this all the 60 questions you will definitely score good in your upcoming examination so please do not worry and without wasting any time let's proceed with the first questions so the first question is to serially shift a byte of data into a shift register there must be option number a one clock pulse one load pulse eight clock pulse and last option is one clock pulse for each one in the data so the correct option of this question is option number 3 which is 8 clock pulse okay next question is generally what is used to construct shift register option number a d flip flop option number b half adder third option is full adder and last option is full subtractor so the correct option of this question is option number a which is d flip flop next question a 4 bit serial in a 4 bit serial in parallel out shift register is initially set to 1111 the data 1010 is applied to the input of the three clock cycles the output will be what option a 1100 option 2 0101 option 3 1011 and last option is 1010 so the correct option of this question is option number b which is 0101 next question which operation are used for addition subtraction increment decrement and complement function option a bus memory transfer arithmetic operation and last option is all of these so the correct option of this question is option number d which is all of these fifth number question in which of these addressing models a constant is specified in the instructions of after the opcode byte option number a register instruction b number option register specific instruction third option is direct addressing and last option is immediate mode so the correct option of the question is option number d which is immediate mode okay next question in three state gate third position termed as high impedance state which act as option number a open circuit option number b closed circuit second last option is none of these and last option is all of the above so the correct option of this question is option number a which is open circuit next question shift left is equal to it's a very simple question shift left is equal to option number a multiply by 2 add by 2 divide by 2 or subtract by 2 so the correct option of this question is option number a which is multiply by 2 next question what can be used to store one or more bits of data which can accept and or transfer information serially option is parallel register shift registers counters or none of these so the correct option of this question is option number b which is shift registers ninth number question in an instruction the address part points to the address of actual data the addressing mode is option immediate addressing direct addressing indirect addressing or none of these correct option of this question is option number b which is direct addressing question number 10 the register used as a working area in cpu is program counter instruction register instruction decoder or accumulator correct option of this question is option number d which is accumulator next question the immediate addressing mode of instruction provide the operand in memory location 
ऑप्शन नंबर ए पॉइंटेड बाय द प्रोग्राम काउंटर ऑप्शन नंबर बी नेक्स्ट टू दैट ऑफ ऑप कोड ऑप्शन नंबर सी पॉइंटेड बाय प्रोग्राम काउंटर प्लस वन एंड लास्ट ऑप्शन इज नन करेक्ट ऑप्शन ऑफ दिस क्वेश्चन इज ऑप्शन नंबर बी विच इज नेक्स्ट टू दैट ऑफ ऑप कोड क्वेश्चन नंबर ट्वेल्व ओवरफ्लो कंडीशन अकर इन विच ऑफ द फॉलोइंग लॉजिक शिफ्ट माइक्रो ऑपरेशन ऑप्शन इज अर्थमेटिक शिफ्ट राइट ऑप्शन बी इज अर्थमेटिक शिफ्ट लेफ्ट सी ऑप्शन इज लॉजिकल शिफ्ट लेफ्ट एंड लास्ट ऑप्शन इज सर्कुलर शिफ्ट लेफ्ट करेक्ट ऑप्शन ऑफ दिस क्वेश्चन इज ऑप्शन नंबर बी विच इज अर्थमेटिक शिफ्ट लेफ्ट थर्टी नंबर क्वेश्चन विच वन ऑफ द फॉलोइंग मल्टीप्लेक्सर्स वुड हैव अ फोर विथ डेटा सिलेक्ट इनपुट फोर इज टू वन मल्टीप्लेक्सर टू इज टू वन मल्टीप्लेक्सर सिक्सटीन इज टू वन मल्टीप्लेक्सर और इज एट इज टू वन मल्टीप्लेक्सर करेक्ट ऑप्शन ऑफ दिस क्वेश्चन इज ऑप्शन नंबर सी विच इज सिक्सटीन इज टू वन मल्टीप्लेक्सर फोर्टीन नंबर क्वेश्चन प्राइमरी कंडीशन टू इनपुट डेटा इन टू रजिस्टर इज अ वेरी सिंपल क्वेश्चन and also very important question in fact all the questions are very important do not skip any of the question primary condition to input data into register option a clock is equal to 1 or load is equal to, means both clock and load is equal to 1 or both clock and load is equal to 0 or either clock is equal to 0 or load is equal to 1 Or clock is equal to 1 and load is equal to 0 and so the correct option of this question is option number A, which is clock and load both is equal to one. Which of the following pair of instruction is a typical arithmetic instruction? Option number A, clear and complement. Option number B, increment and decrement. Option number C, arithmetic shift right and add. And last option is subtract and exclusive or. So the correct option of this question is option number C, which is arithmetic shift right and add is the typical arithmetic instruction. Next question is, what is the number of input and output of a half adder? Option is two input and one output. B option is two input and two outputs. C option is two inputs and three outputs. And last option is three inputs and two outputs. So the correct option of this question is option number B, which is two inputs and two outputs. Seventeenth number question: A register is a combination of flip flops, logic, logical gates. C option is both and B, and last option is none. Correct option of this question is option number A, which is flip flops. 18th number questions which of the following affects the processing power assuming they do not influence each other a statements given are data bus capabilities of uh, uh, statement number 2 is addressing scheme and last statement is clock speed so the correct option of this question is option number 4 because both the three statements are correct Second last question of this series is which language is specified a digital system which uses a specified notation option is arithmetic option b is register transfer second last option is logical and last option is all of these correct option of this question is option number b which is register transfer and last question of this entire session is the memory verse is also referred as option number a data verse option number b address verse option number c memory verse and last option is all of these so the correct option of this question is option number a which is data verse so this is all for today's session thank you so much guys for watching this video if you guys enjoyed watching the videos please do not forget to like the videos and also share this videos to your friends and classmates and do not forget to subscribe the channel thank you so much guys.